match. What's happening now? Well, right now, the last of the fans and the staff are making their way home. It was a very loud and exciting second half for Sacramento Republic. But like you mentioned, some of the team's most loyal fans decided they needed to stay quiet during the first half of this game. They want the team to put out a statement, put out some sort of stance after the Supreme Court made its decision to overturn Roe v. Wade. The sign that hung in front of some of Sacramento Republic's most loyal fans said more than they did during the first half of Saturday's game. The silence on this is just, it's deafening. The Tower Bridge Battalion, usually crowd leaders with their chanting, drumming and cheering for the team, isn't accustomed to being silent. I would love them to make a statement um, saying that, you know, they're, they're supportive of reproductive rights or women's rights or however. They choose to word it. Board member Megan Dendorfer says she's not used to the team staying silent either. When you had a full 24 hours of sports team after sports team, the Sacramento Kings put out a statement and silence from a team that is normally like very proactive. The independent supporter group put their decision out on social media ahead of the game against Oakland. Some supporters said they were disappointed in the battalion's decision. My thought is I come here for sports, not uh, anything political. For the club to take an official stance, uh, I, I, I truly don't know if that would be appropriate or not. It is going to be strange to hear the Tower Battalion being quiet for a half, and they are the leaders of, of the crowd noise. The battalion was back to doing what they do best during the second half of the game. <laughs> A spokesperson for Sacramento Republic said they didn't wish to put out a statement in regards to the group's silent protest. And yes, this second half did get quite loud, very exciting, lots of people pouring out here. We, the drumming just stopped just a few minutes ago, did end in a 3-3 draw. We're going to leave it to Dapper to show you the highlights and explain what that means coming up in sports. Reporting in Sacramento, Leanne Denier, KCRA 3 News. All right, Leanne, thank you.